Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So another day and another new feature has rolled out for Google Chrome's new split view feature that is currently being tested in preview. And yesterday I posted that the feature will let you swap split tabs, just like in Microsoft Edge. I'll leave that video linked. And in today's quota for the new split view feature in Chrome, Google has rolled out another um, new feature at this stage, though, it doesn't work, but that's common in the new features that start rolling out into the Canary version, currently sitting on version 137. So with the toggle, if we right click now, we've got a couple of options in a new menu. So here we can see we can reverse views, but as mentioned, if I click on it, it does nothing. So it's still early days, but it'll give us a general idea. So we can reverse views, which means it will swap those tabs around. We can switch to a horizontal layout. So that's very similar to what we get in Edge where this will um, change into a horizontal layout. You can close this view or separate view. So um, what I'm understanding by that means it'll open up each of these in its own window or in its own tab. Too early to say, but um, I think this is a nice move. So if we head over to Microsoft Edge and we head to split view, here we can see very similar to what we are getting in the Edge browser. S separate two tabs, switch left and right tabs, switch to vertical, switch to horizontal. So this is very similar to that horizontal vertical um, option that's become available now, which um, I think is a nice move, just gives you a bit of option. So you get the uh, general idea. So, so the split view feature in Google Chrome um, obviously is Google's attempt to play catch up with Edge browser in the ongoing browser wars. And there's a lot of backwards and forwards kind of cross pollination of the features between the two browsers in that actual attempt to outperform each other for want of a better word. But I think this is nice. I think it gives us a couple of options. Hard to say if any more will be added, but when this becomes a working feature and um, I can actually show you something in real time. I'll post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.